We are so excited to welcome you here to the ribbon cutting for the CBNI Advanced Prototyping and Manufacturing Facility. With this laboratory, our students will have access to the most advanced technology. And one thing that we really do want to emphasize at Texas Tech is those out-of-classroom experiences enhance what they learn in the classroom so that we prepare career-ready engineers. I want to applaud Dean Sacco for his vision and leadership in the, in the in school or College of Engineering. I think uh, he's very challenging to the students and the faculty and to all of us uh, as far as moving forward and, and keeping our standards high. And I want to congratulate him uh, and the inspiration that he gives for the faculty. We're building the college on three things. Uh, quality in everything we do. And if you look around here, uh, you'll see it. It's quality in everything we do. Uniqueness. And the unique part of this is we're bringing prototyping together with advanced manufacturing. That's not done in many places. You either have a prototyping lab, you have an advanced manufacturing lab, but you don't have them integrated. So that's the uniqueness. And the final thing is recognition. And believe me, we're going to get a lot of recognition for this. So the engineers we recruit from Texas Tech are not only well prepared and qualified, they certainly understand the latest advancements in engineer science and technology. But we also think the students from Texas Tech are ready to solve big challenges and, and apply innovative ideas and emerging technologies and really that's, that's the, the reason that we're here today. We're doing what I call going back to the future and the idea is we produce great engineers that have a theoretical background but to understand what that theory and that math means in a real physical sense you have to do it with your own hands. So in my day, way back when, I always use the example when we built an automobile, we went to a junkyard and pulled a chassis out of one place, an engine block out of another place, a timing light out of another place, we'd use that to set the dwell, which you guys don't even know about, the dwell angle and compression ratios. We didn't know what we were doing, but we knew from experience what would work. And then when we went to college, it all made sense, because the math came together with, with what we had learned physically and we always remembered it. It made us more innovative. You know, they talk about innovation today. Innovation is a big part of not just having the education you have theoretically here, which is excellent, superb, as good as any place in the country, but simultaneously now you're going to be able to apply it. The real path to excellence is through philanthropy and through investment with corporate partners uh, as we are celebrating here today. It's really uh, unique for our students to have the types of opportunities they have here with this new lab. Uh, and that wouldn't be possible but for the investment CB&I uh, has made with us. Your investment of your company uh, is really significant and we look forward to a continued partnership with you. We want to produce the types of students that work well in your industry, work well in all of industry and I think that's what Texas Tech is all about. Let's put students out there that can get the job done, make America better and be creative, invent and provide a better future for all of us. So thank you for this opportunity, this partnership. We appreciate everything that you do.